later on in sight, tightening sanctions once again on the Democratic People's Republic of Korea. The UN Security Council has unanimously adopted a new resolution. It targets the DPRK's coal industry, setting a cap on the amount it can export. The goal to reduce Pyongyang's ability to fund its nuclear program. UN correspondent Liling Tan has a preview. Following nearly three months of negotiations, especially between China and the U.S., the Security Council has imposed the toughest sanctions yet on the DPRK. The resolution caps the country's annual coal exports at 400.9 million U.S. dollars, or 7.5 million metric tons per year, in a move aimed at crippling a key source of revenue for the DPRK, believed to be making its way into the country's nuclear program. Coal exports are now only allowed for the livelihood of people in the DPRK. Now, U.S. Ambassador Samantha Powers said the binding cap would cut what the DPRK earns by about $700 million a year, or more than 60 percent of the country's coal export revenue. But it isn't just coal. The latest restrictions also include an embargo on the sale of metals, including copper, nickel, silver and zinc. The unanimous vote at the U.N. signals the growing concern among the international community over Pyongyang's nuclear weapons development, following its fifth and largest nuclear test this past September. Now, China's ambassador to the UN, Liu Jiayi, said shows the uniformed stand of the international community against the DPRK's missile, nuclear missile program while taking into consideration the plight of its people. But uh, the Chinese ambassador stressed that the real solution is for parties to return to negotiations and resume the six-party talks and move the Korean armistice agreement to a peace treaty. He also made it pointedly clear that Beijing objects to the U.S. deployment of its THAAD missile system in the Republic of Korea and wants it stopped, warning that instead of resolving tensions on the Korean peninsula, it would further destabilize the region. Li Lingtan, CCTV, New York.